What is up guys, it's CokeBoyJ here bringing you guys another commentary. Got you guys this Call of Duty 4 gameplay here in the background. And I'll be talking about the maps that I believe won't make it in to COD 4 Remaster since they're only bringing back 10 maps. I will not be talking about DLC maps because I have not played DLC in COD 4, never have. Um, never think I will until unless they do put some DLC maps into the game for COD 4 Remaster. But we're going to be talking about the base game. The maps that came with the base game, I believe it was 16 maps that came with the base game. So we're going to be talking about those. So, the maps that I think will not make it is Block, Countdown, Downpour, Showdown, Wet Work, and maybe Vacant. Vacant, I'm a little shaky on. I don't think that Vacant will make it. Um, another map that I'm kind of shaky on that won't make it is pipeline i i like pipeline a lot pipeline is one of my favorite ground war maps and now uh, i have a feeling that they're not going to bring the game the map into the game which it's a really good ground world map which i'm expecting them i'm expecting them to pick ground war in the game for sure since it's a remaster so hopefully they do bring ground war hopefully they do bring pipeline because pipeline is a really good ground world map so let me explain to you guys why i believe some of these maps won't make it so starting from the top we have block now block is somewhat of a boring map to play on and that's that's pretty much what it is um when you have 16 maps you're obviously going to have boring maps but you're going to have a lot of good maps as well so i believe that block is one of the boring maps inside the game another boring map that i think is in the game is countdown now the thing about countdown is Countdown is very one-dimensional, it's very linear, as of most COD 4 maps are. Most COD 4 maps are very linear, not very vertical. So, with Countdown, there's very little cover, especially when you're playing in a 9v9 playlist. Anybody can get anywhere in the map and do anything that they want. You can't really establish dominance on the map. You can't really establish great map control on that map because it's so hard to keep them within their spawn. So, um... Countdown's one of the maps that I believe is not going to make it. Another map that I'm pretty shaky on that I think will make it but kind of not won't make it is District. I'm sort of leaning on the side of District not making it into COD 4 Remastered because it's not one of the most um, popular maps. I mean, it's, it's a really good map to strategize around since there is a couple of lanes that you can take to get within the enemy spawn. But I don't think it's really going to make it since it's not that popular. Downpour, obviously the map that I'm playing on right now in this gameplay. Really not an enjoyable map to play on. Um, now, some of these maps that were remastered. Not remastered, but that were brought into MW2. I don't think will make it. Like, Overgrown. I'm sort of shaking on I don't think Overgrown will make it. Same thing with Vacant. I mean, we play those maps in MW2. So, I highly doubt they'll bring either one of them back into it. Because... It's like we played it a lot, so um So it's either between overgrown or vacant that's not gonna be inside the game. Obviously shipment. Shipment is very popular. I mean if you want to one v one somebody, meet me on shipment. Um what are other maps? Um Showdown is definitely not making it. Showdown and also wet work. Those two maps aren't making it. I mean, um there's a lot of corners to camp in inside showdown. So hard to really establish map dominance i mean yeah you can hold them in the spawn but like it's just a weird map so um those are the maps that i believe are not going to make it and every other map i will explain in the further video so yeah this is pretty much it for the video guys make sure you guys leave a comment subscribe if you haven't already and i'm out guys peace